Hello and welcome to Ovation Boats. My name is Julia Mason and I'm at the workshop today on the 1st of April. It's not an April Fool's joke um, because we've got an open day. So as you can see behind me, we've got the roller shutter doors down. We've got the sign up so that people can see where we are. If I pan around, the doors open, we've got flags up. We've got the van there advertising where we are and then we come round here and there's a tractor with a great big boat right across where our visitors are going to be coming. Um, so if you come into the Ovation Boats open day, look for the big purple boat and look for the flags. So what I'm going to do now, before everybody starts arriving, I'm just going to take you into the workshop to show you what we've done so far. We've got three boats that are available for you to view. All of them are in various stages of construction, but all are looking very good and we're very pleased with them. Now, we're taking one of the boats to the Crick Boat Show. That is the boat that you'll see that it looks white. It's actually got a covering, or two coverings of primer over the steel. Um, and that's going to be painted uh, very soon. But, but Janus has taken priority. She's in the paint booth. The Crick boat will be going into the paint booth after Janus has been painted. And then the two boats together will be being fitted out along with Rest and Be Thankful, who is currently in our outside slot. Um, rest and Be Thankful, the back deck is undercover and there are steps to go up and down so so our guys will stay nice and dry and the inside of the boat will be nice and dry as the fit out is progressing so i'll turn the camera around and we'll see what we shall see so coming through the door and that is what you will be seeing we've got a display we've got two displays actually one of them is showing photographs. One is showing videos of the interiors of the boats that we've done previously, or some of the boats that we've done previously. We have biscuits, always worth coming to an event if there's biscuits on, uh, on offer and water. We've got sweets. We have all the traditional things for an open day. We've got the pens, we've got the leaflets, we've got the business cards. Everywhere is clean and tidy. As I said outside, we've got Janus who is in the paint booth there. This is the Crick boat that I was telling you about outside. So we've got quite a good coat of primer on there. And I think there's another coat of primer going on, I seem to have been told. Darren's there, morning Darren. So Darren has just confirmed there will be another coat of primer. We'll have a sand and coat. Yeah, so the Crick boat, as yet unnamed, will be having a sanding down and then another spray coat of primer. And then what we've got here is rest and be thankful. And if you follow our videos, you will have seen her being moved the other day. We've got the lights on. She has started being fitted out. Um, she's got the linings in. I think she's probably got the bulkheads in now. The guys are going to be working on her pretty much full time now. We're hoping to get her completed. We hope to get rest and be thankful completed for May. And we hope to have the Crick Boat completed for May and the Crick Boat Show. And then Janus here. Oh my goodness me. <laughs> we are going to be so busy, but she will be hopefully completed for May too. Now, if I show you the front of Janus, um, I have mentioned before, she's got forward doors, but they're more like windows. Um, inside, she has got... Um, a king size bed which goes right to the front of the boat. Now when Janus came in the other day she'd already had um, a coat of top coat on the cabin top and the cabin sides. 
I can see now that she's been sanded down and she's had another coat of paint on the cabin side. So she's really, she's really moving ahead. So you've got all these health and safety. Don't go through those doors. Don't fall off the end. Let's have a quick look, quick peep inside. Whoa, look at this. She's looking good. She's looking very good. So if I just, I'm not going to give you a, a proper tour because uh, A, I'm hoping that you'll come down in person and B, I shall be doing an individual tour later. So these grey cupboards that uh, Janus has got on, um, the couple have asked for galley cupboards that are similar to um, the ones that are on the narrowboat Grace. Uh, it's Boomers on board, Karen and Rob Bent. So these cupboard doors will be coming off and they will be replaced with a with a galley cupboard door which has like an inset panel. We have a dinette, Pullman dinette. There's doors either side. So this boat has moved on since I saw her the other day. This is a this is a brick. It needs pointing up. It's not a proper house brick. It's a it's a brick for tiling. So it's going to have a solid fuel stove. Said before in previous videos that's a, a shelving unit for a record collection. Handmade vanity unit and basin. The floor below, if I just lift this up, it's a grey slate coloured, um, I think it's a vinyl, it might even be a, a vinyl lino type of uh, covering. Sometimes we have click, click vinyl tiles but I don't think we have this time. A wooden door, we haven't got the handles and catches on yet. But these doors look absolutely beautiful. They're, they're smooth, they're attractive, and I wish we had smelly vision because uh, the smell of the wood is wonderful. Going into the bedroom, as I said outside, we've got this king-size bed. It's got little um, storage units either side, which can also be used to put the... Uh, the early morning cup of tea on, shelving units there. This has all been built to the customer's requirements. We work very closely with our customers. Whatever their dream is, we will, we will provide it. We will build it. So there we are. So I'm going, to, I'm going to take you back through the boat so you can have a view of the graphite, towel rail and radiators. The below cabin sides T and G effect painted boarding and painted upper cabin sides. Just quickly pointing these things out because what I'm going to do now is another video, but I'm going to take you on the other boats that we've got. So this boat is Janus. She's a 60 foot reverse layout. Now she's got a cupboard there which is very similar to Grace. It will have, I believe, uh, glazed um, doors. Ooh, what have we got here? Oh, 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 now every girl should have one of these. I've always wanted one of those. They seem to be fitted on the boats, but uh, they don't seem to get as far as my house. Right, we've got, a, now I'll point out now, we've got a Thetford Midi Prima oven with separate grill here. I think this is where the microwave will go. The electric store is all nice and tidy. It will be tidied up some more. There's work ongoing there. And we've got storage. Oh, sorry about the blurred. We've got storage there. Um, I shall be on this boat on Monday um, painting the internal lockers. As you can see, they've been sanded down. The prime has been sanded down. There's been a first coat started of the undercoat, but um, we ran out of time the other day. So this is Janus. 
in the paint booth, ready to be painted. It's had a second coat of top coat on and we will now be looking at doing the inner panel on the cabin sides. <laughs> 